You're checking out Power99.com. Don't stop. It's Power 99 Rise and Grind Morning Show. Mother Knows and Roxy Romeo with a special guest on the phone. Good morning. It's Big Les. Yes, yes, <laughs> yes, Big Les. <laughs> you got it. <laughs> What's up, Big Les? Hey, y'all. How you doing? Uh, good. How are you? feeling good, Big Les. I'm amazing. Thank you so much for having me. No, thanks so much for calling. Listen, Big Les, I used to watch you on Video Music Box in the videos. Yes, yes. Turning it out. <laughs> Thank you. TV One is celebrating the 25th anniversary of Living Single with a three-day marathon featuring every single episode of its five-season run beginning tonight at 7 p.m. We have Leslie Cigar, a.k.a. Big Les, on the phone. Les is the silhouette dancer at the beginning of Living Single. That would be me. Listen, if you don't know Big Les for any other reason, you know her from that silhouette. Can I tell you, who would have ever thunk that in the world, with all the work that I've been blessed to do, that this is a, like the most memorable piece of work? I can't believe it. <laughs> well, Big Les, to be, to be honest, you was dancing, you was working like the rent was due under the Brooklyn Bridge. Honey, the rent is always due. Yes, Les! Like, <laughs> like they say on Purple Rain, gotta keep the lights on. <laughs> and you definitely been keeping the lights on. How did you get the gig on Living Single? Well, it's so crazy because the directographer, Otis Salid, who has worked with Spike Lee under, you know, so many of his movies, Malcolm X, and has done some of the most greatest dance memorable scenes, even from, like, school days, if you remember the, you know, the good, bad hair and all that stuff. He's the one who choreographed and shot that stuff. He's amazing. And I didn't get a chance to work with him. I just missed um, Malcolm X because I was, I think, on tour or something like that. But he was familiar with me. I get a call. He's like, listen, I don't have the gig, but I have this idea. And I think if we shoot something and present it to them, I think I can make it stick. So we head to the Brooklyn Bridge and up under the bridge, and we start doing a whole bunch of freestyle. And I'm flipping and carrying on all day on cobblestone. And sure enough, he put it together and presented it to them, and they were like, we'll take it. And we were like, what? <laughs> so it really was a first for both of us. We didn't have the job. It was just an idea that he threw at the wall, and it stuck. And that last scene that you see me leaning back was really, we had been shooting for hours, and I was straight up exhausted. <laughs> and it looked like it happened on purpose. So that was nothing but God, too. So. Well, Big Les, you have a lengthy resume. And I know that you stay busy. So what do you have going on now? You know, it's time to take the steering wheel. It's one thing to be a chick in front of the microphone holding the mic, but I'm out here trying to get some of that Ryan Seacrest Carson daily oh, money. Get it, I get it. Contract. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, it's time that I have my own production deal and all that other stuff. So I'm really, like, working on content. I'm working on doing a dance documentary that's going to highlight, you know, the, the female dancers from the golden era. I'm working on a choreography show that's, you know, kind of going to rival So You Think You Can Dance and all that stuff. And, you know, that would have been great for my era for us to be dominating the networks with all these dance shows. So might as well, you know, hop on that bandwagon, too. And, uh, you know, really create a, a dope broadcast that's going to uh, bridge the gap between the old school and new school hip-hop and propel it forward internationally. And so I'm working on a lot of stuff and just trying to get the right deal to make it happen. Les, how has Living Single changed your career? Oh, my God. You know, in the streets, people be like, aren't you that girl who, you know, you do the backflips? And then, <laughs> you know, it became that, wait a minute, I know that body. I could be standing at the bank and somebody would look at my shoulders or the way that I walk and be like, wait a minute, aren't you that silhouette girl? Aren't you that, the girl from Living Single? And it really, to this day, I can go anywhere. Or people like, I'll be in the airport, and whether it's people from our era or people whose parents taught them about, you know, our era of good hip-hop music and all the culture of the films and TV shows, people will recognize me. They kind of put a name to a face. And, you know, Rhapsody absolutely helped me do that, too, you know, becoming from that girl who dances or that girl who backflips with everybody to, oh, snap, that's Les. And she has a microphone now, and she's, you know, introducing us to new people of the hip-hop game. So, yeah, Living Single really just kind of, like, gave my silhouette a persona and a life of its own, which is just crazy. But I'm a rock with it till the wheels fall off. Now, let's talk about this marathon that's coming on. What will the mega marathon include? Well, first of all, it's going to be like 118 episodes, right? Damn. Wow. 
Friday, the 24th, 7 p.m. Eastern, all the way through Sunday uh, till about 5 or 6 o'clock uh, Eastern time. And you're going to see everybody just crazy. Khadija, Regine, Kyle, Overton, Max, and Claire, just doing the best. You know, your cameos that we forgot about, and that means we get to see Heavy D again. Yes. Which will be great, you know. All the love triangles and Regine and her wigs. It's just going to take you back to a place where, you know, laughter on the couch was a really good thing amongst, and amongst the family, you know. It's so crazy that it's 25 years. I know. That was, I my, that was my show. That was definitely my show. Absolutely, because in my brain, I'm still 25. I'm like, wait a minute. What, <laughs> what happened? Les, I'm surprised you never auditioned for a role on Living Single. Well, listen, I'm surprised, too, because it's not without effort. I truly was, I remember myself and my agent calling Yvette Lee Bowser, calling the casting department, really trying, trying, trying to get in. And they just were like, nope, we don't need to see her. Nope. No, thanks. No, we don't think she's right. So hopefully if they really do a reboot and, you know, the girls all, you know, their contracts are right and their money's right and everybody decides to do it, that I'll get a second chance and I can be that neighbor upstairs who's dancing, making noise. Or if you remember that character on Dave Chappelle, I'll even take the one who does the uh, robot in every scene and just kind of walks across. (laughs) Randomly, I'm like, yes, I want to be part of it. I'm the homegirl, too, you know? Yes, you are. And that throwback video that you posted of Mary J. Blige's Real Love video, it just gave me so much life, Les. Oh, yes. You know what's so crazy is that not just the whole Mary J. and people are, like, throwing clips at me, but there are so many people that have remixed and reshot the open to Living Single. If you go on YouTube, if you go on Instagram, people have done their own versions of, you know, keep your head up, what? Keep your head up, and they send it to me, and it is the best tribute ever. So dope. So thank everybody for that. Well, Les, thank you for calling in. Let the people know one more time what's going on this weekend. That's right. The 25th anniversary of Living Single. You can catch it on TV One. Hulu is also showing it. And you guys make sure that you follow me at I am Leslie C-R-S-E-G-A-R. Also at your girl, Les, L-E-Z. All right? We got more to come, and I'm going to see you guys soon. Back on the big screen and the small screen. Hey, Les. Yes, we are living in <laughs> hey, yeah, single, single. <laughs> in the 90s kind of world. I'm glad I got my girl. Go. Keep your head up. Work. Keep that. All right, all right, all right. <laughs> much love to you, lads. Don't be a stranger. Thank, Thank you so much. Mwah. Mwah.